And winds are level up. Okay. Wow! So we found a couple of items. Um, Even longbow? No, it's not. It's not that good. The edge. That's a. That's a nice dagger. Where, we, where did we find that one? Six damage. Anyway. Let's enter the gauntlet, which is the next area. But I'm incredibly happy with how that went. Extremely well, I think. Extremely well. Three tries and we killed the High Dragon. And this is the Gauntlet. This is not Shall we go? The rest of the temple. This part is unblemished. Untouched. I'm here for the urn of sacred ashes. You have come to honor Andraste, and you shall, if you prove yourself worthy. I need the ashes to cure a noble man. Still, you must prove yourself worthy. It is not my place to decide your worthiness. The gauntlet does that. If you are found worthy, you will see the urn and be allowed to take a small pinch of the ashes for yourself. If not... What is the gauntlet? The gauntlet tells the true pilgrims from the false. You will undergo four tests of faith, and we shall see how your soul bears. Alright, let's get this over with then. Before you go, there is something 
I see that the path that led you here was not easy. There is suffering in your past. Your suffering, and the suffering of others. You abandoned your father and mother, leaving them in the hands of Rendon Howe, knowing he would show no mercy. Do you think you failed your parents? The answer is my own, Guardian. Very well. You know your own. I'm glad you declined. This question has nothing to do with our goal. One wonders why you are afraid to answer such a simple question. Perhaps your reticence says more than you ever could. What's past is past. Why bring it up and open old wounds? And what of those that follow you? Ask your question, Guardian. I am ready. You are Emperor the Advisor, ready with a word of wisdom. Do you wonder? If you spout only platitudes, burned into your mind in the distant past, perhaps you are only a tool used to spread the word of the circle and the chantry. Does doubt ever chip away at your truths? You frame the statement in the form of a question, yet you already know our answers. There is no sense in hiding, is there? Yes, I do doubt at times. Only the fool is completely certain of himself. And you, why do you say the Maker speaks to you, when all know that the Maker has left? He spoke only to Andraste. Do you believe yourself her equal? I never said that. I... In Ole, you were someone. In Lothering, you feared you would lose yourself. Become a drab sister and disappear. When your brothers and sisters of the cloister criticized you for what you professed, you were hurt, but you also reveled in it. It made you special. You enjoyed the attention, even if it was negative. You're saying that I made it up for... for the attention? I did not. I know what I believe. And you, Morrigan, Flemeth's daughter, what? Be gone, spirit. I will not play your games. I will respect your wishes. The way is open. Good luck, and may you find what you seek. Interesting. A test of faith. Okay. Echoes from a shadow realm, whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night, is swept away by dawning light. Of what do I speak? Dreams. A dream came upon me as my daughter slumbered beneath my heart. It told of her life and of her betrayal and death. I am sorrow. Yeah. Fine. What's your uh, riddle, spirit? I am neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong, that belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? Home. It was my dream for the people that... Okay, two. A poison of the soul, passion's cruel counterpart. From love she grows, till love lies slain. Of what do I speak? Jealousy. Yes. Okay. She wields the broken sword, and separates true kings from tyrants. Of what do I speak? Mercy. Yes. Okay, excellent. No man has seen it, but all men know it. Lighter than air. Of what do I speak? Sharper than any sword. Hunger. Yes. I. Okay. The moon 
corners of the world stretch towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. Of what do I speak? Mountains. Yes. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The debt of blood. Of what do I speak? Vengeance. Yes. Wind. 